Hello friends, welcome to an academy. I am Smita. I have prepared this lesson on the resources and timetable you can uh, do for the NEET UG preparation. Now do read, review, recommend the lessons. You can follow me at the link provided here. Queries and reviews are always welcome. Now let's move to the lesson. Now uh, as uh, the resources are concerned for the NEET UG biology preparation, uh, do uh, in uh, I just want you to be in mind that I am talking here about the only in biology uh, section of the NEET UG. I am not talking about the other part of the NEET UG. So uh, do the uh, follow these things for the NEET UG syllabus of biology. Uh, so. As the uh, resources are concerned, I think the NCRTs of class 11th and 12th of biology is sufficient for the biology section. I don't think you should go to the other sources because it is uh, seen from the previous year papers that the questions are based out of NCRTs only. So if your base is clear and you have sufficient time, then only you can jump to other books. Uh, I, although uh, NCRTs are sufficient and also the unacademy lessons enroll in your topic of choice whatever uh, topic you are facing problem or you think it is good for you then enroll yourself in the particular topic and complete them as uh, it is very important you can uh, listen and uh, go while traveling while doing anything or uh, while roaming around you can listen the uh, lessons it is very easy and also you should know that the listening and watching has great impact on your brain than reading if you read the same chapter you will not grasp as much you can uh, grasp by the watching the videos over this or listening the topics so uh, you should know these things and uh, also for the preparation of uh, entrance examination it is very important you should be healthy and fit so for this it is not like uh, you always be in a uh, study mode or you always prepare for the exam you don't give time to yourself so it is very important to do exercise have the habit of having uh, healthy food and do play your favorite game it is very good it enhances uh, your motivation it makes you confidence so do uh, play your favorite game football cricket whatever you like or uh, your favorite hobby gardening or roaming traveling reading novels or you can do that it is not like uh, 24 uh, tw into 7 you will study 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 it's not like that so try to solve previous year question it is the key to go through these entrances and time management it is very important uh, because in examination you will get the 180 uh, minutes like 3 hours so in 180 minutes you have to solve 180 questions now uh, you uh, should know in that also you have to fill the uh, OMR sheet and also in between your signature your thumb and uh, also you will uh, take 5 to 10 minutes to go to um, uh, you can say to um, go to that atmosphere to solve the paper so in total you will not get one minute to solve a question you will get less than one minute so to solve a question so it is very important to be quick in your solving pattern and uh, so it is very important to manage your time else you will finishing up with the uh, half of the paper only you will left uh, half of the paper now for NEET it is not like uh, you will uh, do only physics you will do only geology or botany or chemistry no the NEET is revolved by the four subjects together these four subjects together revolve around the NEET if you want to qualify the NEET entrance for the UG MPBS or BTS courses then you should have the command of a botany, geology, chemistry and physics and for bio uh, side uh, student it is uh, seen that they have very weak physics so try to give more time to the numerical portion of the physics part because it will increase your ranking
if you will qualify the entrance and if your physics is also strong then you will get very very good rank and the medical college of your choice so now here i'm discussing about the biology part try to this for physics and chemistry also as you can't grab a seat without commanding all subjects it's not like you will do only geology botany and chemistry and you will get the seat no you have to do the physics also or you cannot go with these three without doing this so you have to maintain a balance between all you have to uh, divide your time between all you have to give uh, questions to all you have to solve the previous year question related to all these subjects now for the strategy part you should do divide the 12 months in four parts 1 2 3 4 and each part is of 3 months now divide your syllabus equally set target for every month that in a month i'll do four units two from class 11 biology two from class 12 biology make short notes it is very important to make yourself notes like you uh, prepare the notes from ncert and you are listening to an academy lessons if you uh, get any additional point regarding any topic any extra um, information regarding any topic you should incorporate this in your uh, short notes this will be very help during the revision time because it is uh, very difficult for you before uh, one week of your exam to go through all the uh, books because they are so bulky to handle and in that at that time you must be in a hurry situation that uh, okay mai ye bhi kar lu oh i have to do this also i have to there do that also i have to solve the numerical also i have to learn the uh, formulas for the physics part also so at that time you cannot do all these things so the, these short notes will be very very helpful now try to achieve the target you have set and if you fail to complete the target in a particular time period then try to cover in the next but don't do this regularly because it is not good if you will postpone the things the things will get piled up and it is not a good sign of your preparation so try to achieve your target now how to prepare for neat biology within a year means within a year how can you complete the syllabus now the examination occur mostly in the month of may as it occurred uh, in 2017 it was on 7th of may so i am giving you the whole month of may i am not considering the may for your preparation so from june onwards you should start your preparation now give you june july and august first two units of class 11th and class 12th biology now for september october and november try to give third and fourth unit of class 11th and class 12th biology now december january and february only unit 5 and revision of all these four units so i think it is not a very big task because in a 3 months you have to do only 4 units and the units of ncerts are not too big that you cannot do so these are not too big target that you cannot achieve in 3 months you have to do 4 units it's very simple you can do with the mcqs by paper solving and uh, by the previous year questions so it is very very good if you will plan like this and in the march april may three months try to do as much as revision you can and previous year question paper and also the mcqs related to these units so you get enough time if the exam is in the first week of may then also you get 
two months for revision and solving the previous year question and mcqs so these are helpful for you if you will plan like this and try to these things for your uh, other two subjects also for your physics and chemistry also so now uh, you will get a systematic study plan and you will end up doing very good and you will definitely get a seat in your medical entrance thank you